Well, hello guys, how are you today? I'm gonna to tell you a story, not a story really, but something happened in my country. If you didn't know, I live in Lebanon, so yeah, there was an explosion of a firework factory, yay! Firework really works, sorry, are really dangerous if you think about it. They're, they're basically bombs, but colorful and they go in the air so i'm gonna tell you what happened and plus we're also gonna play some games so you don't get annoyed or bored i guess i'm not gonna say annoyed so yeah sorry don't leave yet please don't leave yet so yeah subscribe and like <laughs> and if you want to see more please like uh, please comment uh, what you want to see or if you have another idea, whatever you want, really. I don't have any problems whatsoever. So, yeah, I'm just gonna jump in a game right now and see what will happen. Back up, okay, headshot, and primary, special, okay. So, basically, an explosion happened, and my friend's dad, or I guess you can see his kind of related but kind of not uh, you can just say that and and ex his dad literally was a little bit close to him to the explosion don't you worry the family is fine the dad was in the office when it exploded and he kind of got the office got destroyed a little bit and he got injured we haven't heard of him until yesterday and really the night we haven't slept until we heard that his family told us that he was okay. So basically he was unconscious, he, he really wasn't like feeling okay if you wanna say. He's in the hospital, I think he got out maybe, I, I'm sorry, if don't say too much detail. No, but yeah, he was basically kind of dead. We thought he was dead, but thank goodness he was alive. There were over three million people who got injured in the fire, in the explosion, and a lot of them lost their lives. And you can imagine, today they're still trying to find some people that are still missing. Just imagine somebody's dad right now is missing or mom literally under like an explosion like how crazy is that like just think about it if your dad was under like rocks or missing wouldn't, wouldn't you be like scared so basically uh, how it happened is stupid workers over there were fixing the door and we, there was a lot of fireworks bags full of them so basically they lit them on fire by a mistake and it caused a lot of harm and a lot of people died so basically over i don't know how many exactly but definitely over like Maybe half a million, I don't know, but a lot of people died. A lot of people are okay though, more than that died, but a lot of people are still missing or dead if you want to say it like this way, but yeah. So we don't know anything about them, we don't know if they're still alive, we don't know if they're okay, we don't know if they're on, in a coma, like they can be a big possibility they are in the coma, I mean... He was in a coma, but he got out, so yeah, good thing. Now, basically, it was a mistake of workers that are stupid. They didn't take any security, safety measures. They literally just let off a hundred trillion. I'm, I'm just kidding. Like, a lot, a lot of fireworks that probably shouldn't have been touched really so we were fixing the door for it and it got exploded and there were two explosions the first one wasn't as bad as the second one the second one really 
killed a lot of people like right now one dude literally literally was alive in the first explosion he was calling his dad in half of the call the second explosion came in and just killed him literally so you can say it was a tragic time and it's not like Lebanon had it enough and also my dad uh, uh, was working there in Beirut uh, and now it's called what, what happened there where this happened and uh, don't you worry only a little bit uh, the windows broken when he was working but he was totally fine he wasn't injured or anything and the family of uh, the dad that I just talked about, my friend, is totally fine. I already said that, but if somebody didn't, like, was just tuning in, like, oh, yeah. So, yeah, that was really crazy. We kind of felt it, although we were three hours away. Three hours. Now, I know that might not be, like, crazy amount, but that's pretty crazy. Now, it wasn't that big of uh, like in uh, like a, it's kind of like an earthquake over here but over there it was huge one big explosion that shouldn't have done been if only somebody take took in a little bit of safety measures and that's why i think they should get rid of fireworks i mean they are fun but they're more dangerous. How many times did firework kill somebody? Haven't there been a lot of people who died because of it? Like, d dude, fireworks is not safe. Whatsoever. Imagine just somebody, like, literally letting a firework next to, like, something explosive or something like that. But imagine it was a factory, so yeah. It was a huge explosion, dude. If you've seen it on, on news, I don't know if that was a thing on your country, but it was pretty big explosion. I mean, of course, it's literally a factory. A whole entire factory got exploded because of stupid workers. It didn't take safety measures. This is why the most little things can kill 3 million people almost or injure some of them. Yeah, but a lot of them survived, so don't you worry. A lot of people are uh, alive. Somebody already left this video, right? Nobody's watching right now, right? Who is still watching is a legend. Thank you. My voice is stupid, I already know, but I'm trying to fix it. Don't you worry, I will be better, just, I want a little bit of support, just somebody to talk to, like, you can be my friend if you want, we can be more than friends, I mean, sorry, not what I meant, but okay. Like, we can be, like, uh, almost uh, best friends, really, if you need somebody to talk to. Like a little YouTuber who really doesn't have much to do and doesn't have like a huge audience. You can talk to me while I'm still a small YouTuber. Maybe I will grow, maybe I will stay small. I'm almost 5 subscriber, subscribers, so please subscribe, please, please, please. Now I know what you're saying, thinking. This uh, shouldn't have happened, but... Why? How many dudes died? How many people are still missing? I don't know exactly, but there are a lot of people died. And missing still more than a million. So, or maybe less, I don't know exactly. But definitely a lot of people died. It was tragic, so uh, of course my friends... Dad is still alive, which is crazy. We were so worried I couldn't do a video yesterday before the explosion, or you can say when the explosion happened, when we thought uh, we, they, we, they found him because they told us they found him, but it 
C1. And we didn't think it was that big of a deal. We didn't think the whole entire, like, uh, like city or town, I don't know what you want to call it, uh, is, have been, like, kind of nuked without the nuke part, just bombed. It was a huge bomb, basically, but also a factory, so, like, huge explosion. And it was definitely a tragic time. A lot of people, like I said, lost their lives. Hopefully, a lot of them uh, weren't, like, uh, severely injured that are still alive. Hopefully, a lot of people made it. Hopefully, people are still, still okay and not severely injured. Because if they are alive and almost dead, that won't make difference really am i right no stay back okay so sorry if i'm repeating myself but yeah this was basically the story of the explosion this is what happened if you want to know more about it if you were wondering that's what happened it it was definitely a tragic time like Dude, it was an explosion. Lots of people died. And there is gonna be chest opening happening soon. Silver chest opening. So please subscribe and wait. I'm still a small YouTuber. I don't have any microphone or any com la laptop or computer to like edit good stuff. Yeah, I mean, I have a computer or a laptop if you wanna call it that. But I don't use it to that because I really don't know how. I know it's an app and all, but how to transfer it, I don't know. No, I'm not just a Pixel Gun YouTuber, I'm also like any sort of game, but right now Pixel Gun is what is working really for me, so I'm just gonna keep doing it. And uh, my luck today isn't that great in Pixel Gun. What do you think about the update? Do you think it's good? Do you think it should be reworked? Do you think it, it's not great? Do you think it's amazing? What do you not like about it? What do you like about it? Tell me in the comment section below. Now, I won't make it any longer for you guys. So, I guess this is the end. I totally said, I mean, I think I said every single thing that is important. Still, people are missing and still people are being cured or in the hospital. So, yeah. Excuse my English. But okay. Goodbye, and I see you next time. Thank you for tuning in. Subscribe and like. Bye.